Hey everyone, in today's video I'm going to be doing something a little bit different. I'll be trying out some new makeup and not only is this makeup new, it is brands that I haven't tried out before. So if you want to see how it works out for me, then just keep on watching. So first I'm going to be starting off with Charlotte Tilbury and I'll be using the Magic Foundation and this is supposed to give you flawless long lasting coverage and this one is in 11 Dark. So this is giving me, I would say, like a medium coverage, but it is very buildable and it is drying down to a matte finish. The next I'm going to be using the Retoucher and this is a Conceal and Treat Stick and this one is in 9 Dark. Picking this concealer, I wasn't sure what shade would have worked out nice for me. I would have preferred maybe a lighter shade just to brighten some areas, but this will definitely work good for concealing any areas that are dark. Since this shade matches my skin tone, it'll be perfect for those days when I want light coverage and don't want to wear too much makeup. Next, I'm going to be using the Airbrush Flawless Finish Skin Perfecting Micro Powder, and this one is in 3 Dark. And with this powder, I'm just going to lightly dust it all over my face, and I'm going to focus on my T-zone. All over my lid, I'll be using these two berry tones, and then in my crease, I'll be using this deeper brown tone, and then lastly in my inner corners, I'll be using these two shades. With these eyeshadows, they're very pigmented and have a great texture that blended in nicely. My only disappointment is that on my skin tone, some of the shades swatch differently from how they look, but overall, this is a nice palette with a good range of matte and shimmer finishes. This ultra defining eyeliner is from the brand called Iris Beauty and it's in jet black and when using this product it had a great application. The brush gave me nice precision and the staying power is very long lasting. There was only one slight con and it's when I was taking it off it was a little bit more work versus other eyeliners that I've used but overall it's a great eyeliner. The Quo Illuminating Drops has such a great formula, it's super buttery and honestly this blended in so nicely into my skin and using a little bit goes a long way. This lip gloss is creamy and not sticky at all. It's pigmented, hydrating, and it has no taste, which is something that I really appreciate and look for in a gloss. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you want any more information about any of the products that I showed today, just check the description box below. And don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.